Hey YouTube, it's me at your iPhone Captain. Today we're going to be looking at some of the top city of tweaks for the notification center or banners. And seems like this month has there's been a lot of tweaks come out that dealt with banners. So I want to show you some of my favorites. Uh, I want to start off with one of the new ones, the newest one to the family today, and that one was called Banner uh, Bulletin Pro, and I did a full review on this if you want to check it out. I'll try to remember to annotate this video. Uh, what it does is it allows you to change the size of your notification center. This tweak will be awesome once it's brought over to the iPad. Uh, currently, it is not available for the iPad. Uh, I don't know why, but you can see what it does. It changes the size. I think it's awesome. I think it's something that is very much needed on the iPad. I think the notification center on the iPad looks a little shitty in my opinion. But anyway, you can change the size where it appears. It's on the right, the thinnest. You see how small it is right there. Now, also too, you may be seeing some of these animations that are coming up. Uh, it does include some animation in it right here, and you can disable that if you don't want that in in your note. See, it just sort of popped up that time. Uh, that takes the animation out of it, and you don't have to respring if you don't want to. You know, that's up to you, which that's a little small for my taste, you know, but hey, to each his own. Uh, Personally, I, I'm a fan of the one here. It's called Thin. I like it sort of centered. But I don't know why, but it looks sort of fuzzy. The, the writing does. I don't know if it was supposed to be that way or if that's just happened to be the way it's going to be. I, I, I really don't know. But it works awesome. It's 99 cents in the Big Boss repo. So check it out over there. One of the other awesome tweaks is called Color Banner. In here, you can change the actual color of your banners when they appear. And here's what I mean. Let me send myself an iMessage. Okay. I'm working on sending myself an iMessage right now. It should be coming. Mitch Stevens says test. Sorry about that, guys. That's on my Mac, and that's not what I was wanting to come up. I'm sending myself a test message, and you can see right here the only thing coming up is just the little icon. And another tweak that I have enabled right now that's affecting the way that looks is called mini banners. And this is an awesome tweak, guys. This was just released this week, Mini Banners Pro. And what it does is it shrinks the size of your banners to almost hardly nothing. Uh, right now, they're on the top right. And let's go back in here to Color Banner. And let's just set this up. Let's set it to black. See how this looks. All right, turn it back over to the... And I'm just sending anything here to see what the notification looks like. It should be black when it appears on the screen here. And don't ask me why, but for some reason it takes these sometimes a minute to come through. Even though I'm sitting right on the same Wi-Fi network, I don't know why. But you can still see it come across the screen right there, and it's not really changing anything. Um... For some reason, it's right in the middle. Maybe because I've got all these tweaks enabled where I'm showing this video for banners. All right. Here we got Mini Banners Pro. And there's really no way to disable this one. Uh, you got Mini Banners Pro. And then you got uh, Bulletin Pro. And you got Color Banner. And, of course, IntelliScreen X, you know, what would we be without IntelliScreen X? That's what makes all this possible here on my screen. You see me swiping through my mail, all over into my tweets, Facebook, 
everything. That's that's Intel Screen X. That's nine ninety nine, guys. So if you want to check it out, uh, Bulletin Pro, Bulletin Pro is ninety nine cents, and Mini Banners Pro is ninety nine cents. So those are some pretty awesome tweaks. But you can see right here, the only thing showing right now is the message icon with the little cayenne symbol on it there. So that's that's a little bit off. It needs a little bit of tweaking. And if you're wondering, that is the cradle, the wave cradle um, stand. And it is an awesome stand, by the way. If you want to get you one of those, it's pretty awesome. Let me show you the last tweak of the night for banners. And this one is called Simple Banners. Wouldn't you guess it? Okay, now let me get my iPhone, and what Sample Banners does, let me open it up right here. I've already got everything. You can turn the text, the title, the icon, the name, the sound. You can adjust everything with this. So right now I'm going to turn off the text and the title. And let's go back out and see how this looks when we get a message. Okay. So now test is coming through. While we're waiting, come over to freecityoftweaks.com, iphonecaptain.com. And guys, please like the video. It helps it get seen more. And you can see up here in the corner, the only thing you see in there is just the icon. There's no, there's no uh, name or message in there. And that's what we turned off. And this little thing you see in the corner up here, that's, that's a application called Note iPad. It's it's spelled like not iPad, but it's Notepad, and that's another banner tweak. And there's really nothing to configure on Notepad. Uh, well, I said nothing to configure, uh, and I and I'm eating those words precisely right now. There's everything to configure. I should have said. Uh, you can show your notifications on the left or the right, and you can set your animation. And you can change the color of the background. Let's change it to blue. All right. Now let's 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 look at it. Okay. Let's see what it looks like. And you can change your text color. You can change your title color. Let's change that to orange. Okay. But we'll see. We have right now. We actually have it turned off. Show notifications from. We actually have some of this stuff turned off. End in simple banners so let's disable that and let's go back out now and let's see what this looks like and this is called not a pad not a pad it's 99 cents look at that guys that is awesome off the hook I love that that's not a pad check it out alright guys another awesome banner tweak that you need to be sure and get <clears throat> this one is called banner disable and this is a free tweak, guys. And this is probably one of the most useful banner tweaks in the city of store today. And here's what it looks like when you need to go check it out. Inside city, it's got a little moon. It's by Ron McCower or whatever his name is. And like I said, it is free. And what it does is it puts a little disable switch. If you're in a meeting or... Somewhere where you don't want your banner notifications to appear on your screen, all you got to do is flip this Do Not Disturb sign on, and you won't get any notifications. The only thing that you will see is if you get a, like an iMessage or some other type of phone call or something, you'll still have your badges appear unless you have those turned off. But that's the only thing you'll get. There'll be no sound, no noise, no, nothing appear on the screen. It's very, very useful tweak, and I think it's going to be included in iOS 6, to be honest with you. Check it out. It's free, guys.